Hello friends, it's Read Across America Day. This year we'll be reading Puff the Magic Dragon by Peter Yarrow and Lenny Lipton with paintings done by Eric Poibaret. Here we go. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Little Jackie Paper loved that rascal Puff and brought him strings and sealing wax and other fancy stuff. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Together they would travel on a boat with billowed sail. Jackie kept the lookout perched on Puff's gigantic tail. Noble kings and princess and princes would bow whene'er they came. Pirate ships would lower their flag when Puff roared out his name. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff the Magic Dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. A dragon lives forever, but not so little, not so little girls and boys. Painted wings and giants rings make a way for other toys. One gray night it happened Jackie Paper came no more and Puff that mighty dragon he ceased his fearless roar. His head was bent in sorrow green scales fell like rain. Puff no longer went to play along the cherry lane. Without his lifelong friend Puff could not be brave. So Puff, that mighty dragon, sadly slipped into his cave. Puff, the magic dragon, lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff, the magic dragon, lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Magic Dragon. Thanks for listening.